Hello. The last time we set up the SQL Server 2014 uh, databases, and as we can see here, we have only the system databases in place, no custom database. Of course, it's a fresh copy. So we want to introduce the sample databases that Microsoft provides just to work with it. We head to this uh, link that I provide, of course, again in the description. This is a complete database. Um, you download the file um, and you will get those uh, BAK, BAK back file, which is actually the sequence of a backup file. In the management studio, you click right click on database, restore databases, and then you look for this file. I provided it here on the C directly so I can access it easily. Yes, we will see here uh, the Northwind database, Northwind. Um, when the backup was taken, we also can see that it was a full database backup. We also can see where the data files actually were at the time when it was backup. We can see this when we click on this file tab here. And we will also see on the right hand side where we will restore it to, to restore as, of course it's on our uh, computer. So we leave it like that. Also the options we leave like that and we just uh, hit OK. And we will see the database uh, appear on the left side here. And you can see that we have, uh, besides the system databases, now the Northwind with some precious tables. Okay, so but now we want to also introduce the AdventureWorks database, which is uh, another database uh, that holds uh, like examples. We just had uh, to Google, or I will provide, of course, the link in the description to the AdventureWorks 2012 uh, database files. You download this database uh, file directly, this time not a backup. You see um, the data and the log file here. So we want to uh, attach the database now. We don't want to, to restore it. So we go back to the SQL Server Management Studio. Right click on database and we say attach. Then of course we again we have to look for the uh, AdventureWorks uh, files which is downloaded. We select the MDF file and we will um, see that he also added automatic the log file that is also in the, in the download folder of course. So now we can just say uh, okay and then we also see the AdventureWorks file with all the tables, it's a complex database, yeah. We will need that in the next few lessons, uh, the Northwind database and of course also the AdventureWorks database. So thank you for your time. Um, again, uh, I want to remind you to subscribe uh, so that you don't miss the latest content and uh, I hope you like the content. Please uh, use the comment section below if you have any questions or comments. Uh, I'm happy to hear them.